from the side that was victorious last weekend. Injuries to both Josef Martinez as well as Matias Kokoro up top. Attacking options very limited. On the other side of the coin here for Oscar Perea and Orlando City, 3-2 win at DC United. But there's gonna be one change from that. Opened up, of course, with that draw against CF Montreal. And a goal is draw, so the second time these two meet, this is match day number 10 in CF Montreal. Go from right to left across your screen in their blue and black. And Mesa Toy offside. Looking to go the direct route, and this one forward to set. Quick booking early on. And referee John Freeman having none of it, says let's get on with it. Robin Janssen. That really takes an extra blow tonight when you think about Josip Martinez, who was brilliant last week, and now Sosa just diving in. Able to be available every game so far this season. Such an important piece, really. will do all that dirty work for your team. Here is Piat, and trying to release Toy. Toy is in. Could this be his moment? Mason Toy! You bet! First goal of the season. It's 1-0 to CF Montreal. One of the biggest challenges for a player who hasn't played many minutes is that timing of your runs as a forward. Mason Toy gets it just perfect. Able to get past the line of Orlando City and then past the Peruvian national goalkeeper, Galeze, who comes out. And a little bit of patience here for Mason Toy. Has to eye it up. Make sure he's gonna in this league and his teammates around him. So, but it's gonna have to start to come soon. Lodero plays it in. Muriel back to the ground. All eyes to the referee who points to the spot. It will be a penalty for Orlando City and a booking for Jonathan Sirwa. This will go under review. But high pressure, winning that ball up higher up the pitch. Yeah, it was a poor clearance from Jonathan Sirwa, and then just to see there. As you said, a great ball by Nicholas Ladero. Puts it right into the path and then gets a touch. Luis Muriel, then Jonathan Sirois gets a touch of the ball. And no, I'll tell you what. Of the 13 he's faced, and now it's Facu Torres up against the Canadian keeper to draw level. And it's Torres! No problem. 1 1. Here it's Stab Saputo. Putting a sweet ball right into the path of Luis Muriel and then Fecundo Torres. Automatic from the spot. Jonathan Sirwa going the opposite direction. No chance. And there's that resiliency that we expected to come see from this one. Well, and Cartagena just steps in. He's done a good job of marshalling the center of the park. Lodero now. Muriel. And Muriel! Not a bad effort. And suddenly Orlando are feeling it. Which has been breached 14 times. Coming into match day 10. Fourth most goals allowed in Major League Soccer. See at Montreal with their tail up. It's Campbell. Lines one up and it just dipped late. Not a bad effort. I see what you're saying. An apt comparison. Meanwhile, Torres pulling the strings, trying to slide it through. It's on. Smith! Now the fullback found himself in an attacking position. The referee claims it took a touch, so it'll come out for a corner. And it will be Schwadier, but bending it in rather team fashion to Pedro Galesi. Made it pretty easy. Be aware of those streaking players like Mason Toy and Ariel Lasser, who try and perhaps will find a little bit of that space in behind. Lovely ball for Muriel for an onside. Dagurdan, Torhaltsen, and Torhaltsen picks up his head, sets it into that danger area. And scary moments back there for Siwa. It was a great opportunity for Orlando City. Back and forth we go, and here comes Lasseter, he's in, it's Lasseter! Denied by Galese. Thank goodness, your wish has been granted, my friend. They have gone direct, and they're getting in behind with frequency. Here's Angulo, he's finally in behind, waiting for support. Gets it now, Rodero chips it across, one waiting. My good. My goodness, CF Montreal rocked on the back foot. 
near side now for Lassie Lapalainen. Oh, a careless ball from him. McGuire getting stuck in, but that's wonderful mopping up in midfield from Schwadier. And the touch from Saliba has released Yankov. And now the substitutes combining to good effect. It's on for Sulusi Ibrahim, who checks back. Ibrahim! The follow from Lassiter! It's the winner they wanted! And he can't stop scoring goals! Ari to the rescue! It's 2-1! By Laurent Courtois bringing in Yankov, who threads a ball right into the path of Sanusi Ibrahim. Sanusi Ibrahim's got a chance now to eye this thing up. He's going to decide to bring this back to his right foot. Trouble Pedro Golese. The area last year on the doorstep. We'll get a closer look at it here. Good patience by Sanusi Ibrahim. Fantastic strike. It's a good save by Pedro Golese, but it doesn't get enough of it to direct it wide enough. And Ariel Lasseter expecting some type of rebound, perhaps. Lofted in. And Sosa meets it, headed on by Cartagena. And that ball belted by McGuire, who caught all of it. And that was their chance. My word. Smith. Rafael Santos. Seeing fullback, picking at Cartagena. Good hold up play. McGuire now for Ojeda, back across, it's there, it's on Dulo! Oh my goodness! Another turn! And Orlando, for the second time tonight, has come back from a goal down. The comeback kids have struck again. It's 2-2. Oscar Pereja inserting key players here in this moment. Good layoff by Duncan McGuire and Ojeda, and Ojeda does the right thing, just squares it across, and Ivan Agulo on that backside. Gets himself right in front of Sosa. Or I should say Raheem Edwards there in the end trying to come back and track.